kids are done up. It rained all day yesterday. So it's too muddy to do any hiking. It's too muddy to drive out of here. <laughs> so we thought it would be a great time to try to eat some prickly pear. So this may not be a good idea. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with a big one too. What about this one right down here? Yeah, it down. Free of disease. Yeah, it looks a little dirty, but other than that, it's pretty good. So let's try it. Just to go burn the little pokey things off. And it's not the big ones you're really worried about because you could get all these off, but there's a bunch of these little ones that like to stick in you. So our goal is not to get any of those in our fingers when we do this. Yeah, that's the goal. And if any of you guys are experts at this, I'm sure <laughs> you'll be able to see we're amateurs. Got a little fire going. not much of a fire, so this might take a while. I think you put it like through a long ways. Like in here? Yeah. Like this? Yeah. Into the meat? I think so. Yeah. Alright. Look stable? Feel stable? <laughs> <laughs> Got an uphill slant, we should be alright. Teddy. We did do a pretty dirty one, didn't we? Yeah, we did. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's heavy. Might just leave it here. That is a good cook a lot. Do we need to get the other uh, hot dog stick and put it on the other end? Maybe. Is it handy? Yeah, I'll get it. We had to go for the gusto and get the big one, huh? Alright, prickly pear harvest, take two. Because we already failed. <laughs> we picked the biggest one, the dirtiest one. We broke the hot dog stick and dropped it in the fire, right? <laughs> yeah, nothing else could have went wrong, I don't think. Alright. Well, we could have got poked, but we didn't get poked. Alright, so we're going to try, we think this one. Down close to the bottom. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to solid. Uh, yeah, look at that. See my glove? Oh! <laughs> Alright, so this is one we're gonna try. Okay, take two. Back to the fire. Come on, Myrtle. Watch out for the cactus. Alright, so we're gonna try to get some of these stickers off and then. We're not quite sure how we're gonna put it on our second hot dog stick. That looks like it's working good, huh? Yeah, it looks like it's working. You have to set it down on this bag and do the top where you're at. We've got a lot of the stickers off. Stickers off so. Oh, here's a lot of people use a torch on this and just torch it real quick, but obviously, if you don't have a torch. We used to have a blow torch. Yeah. Not really something we carry in the van, though. Okay, so I think most of them are off, so okay. I think we can get it on the stick now. All right, we got it on the stick. Hopefully it stays on this time. Fire's off. I think you'll start seeing stuff oozing out of it as it cooks. 
Can we do it from this side? Yeah. I'm on the hot side. It spins. How would you just pick the other side? It's like a, it's like a hot marshmallow. <laughs> Cook one side. Let me help you. All right, so we cooked this for a good five, 10 minutes probably. And it started bubbling up and oozing. And it looks like the outside started, set, the skin started separating from the inside. So I, we think it's done. So Carrie's gonna go ahead and cut it. I think you cut it in you want to strips. They say you eat the skin and all. I don't know, his, when I saw him do it, they cut it all way easier than this. Oh, his, maybe his knife was sharper. Should be pretty sharp. There we go. Looks like green goo. Yeah. Alright, I think they've cooled down enough, it's time to try them out. Put a little salt, garlic salt on mine. They're very slimy. A little, a lot. Pepper. You want pepper? No? They're, t they're hard to explain. They're not terrible. They um, taste a lot like the garlic, salt, and pepper I just put on it, and <laughs> I can't really tell what else they taste like. They're slightly tart. They're not bad. They're slimy. Mm. They don't taste slimy though. Kind of like a pickle or something. It's got the consistency of a pickle. Mm. Yeah. And slightly bell pepperish. Not a whole lot of flavor. It's all sticking to my lips. <laughs> I don't know if this would fill you up. You have to eat a lot of You'd these. You'd have to eat quite a few. And I think you have to be pretty hungry. Not that they taste bad, they just don't have much taste to them. Let's see. Do you think we cooked it enough? It's pretty slimy. Anybody knows a good recipe, let us know. There's no shortage of these out here. The slime strings keep sticking to me. Hmm. Not terrible. Not terrible. I think I'm done. You're done? <laughs> Are you done? I'm done. <laughs> I think we should maybe get the hot, real hot dogs out. Yeah, let's get some hot dogs out. <laughs> we tried. Where, Riddle? Come on. Oh. oh, wait. Let me go get them. See if Riddle likes it. Up here. Are you Rudel, what do you think? Do you like it? Oh, oh here, Rudel. What about this one? This one. Yeah, no. Rudel don't like it. Not, not Rudel proof. <laughs> right. Ready for yours? Yeah. <laughs> Rudel approves. <laughs> These are Rudel approved hot dogs. Rudel. Mmm. This is 
is like 15 minutes later <laughs> after the cactus. Cactus wasn't very filling. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.